So we're going to be doing a air filter replacement on the Ram Rebel. So this is a K9 air filter like I showed. This is the model number right there. This is for the Hemi 5.7 liter engine. I believe it fits a 03 on up to a 2019. So if your Ram 1500 falls within those years, that's the part number you're going to need. So all we're going to do is just throw it in there. No tools are required for this. So this is going to be a really short video, just a little quick how-to. So enjoy it. Okay, we're averaging 13.2 miles per gallon right now. I'm gonna drive around for a few hundred miles, see if that changes or decreases. Okay, so I've driven about 400 miles now, um, one tank of gas, more or less, and we can see with the average miles per gallon, we're coming in at 14.3. That's just about one mile per gallon more than the paper stock filter. Okay, so let's talk about some performance gains. Uh, I'm not gonna sit here and blow smoke up your ass and say oh my gosh It feels so much faster than stock because it really doesn't it's a fucking air filter It's really not gonna do that much um, If I'm gonna be hundred percent honest with you I feel like I've kind of lost some of the bottom end torque and I kind of gained a little bit of top end um, I'm not sure if that's actual real data or if it's just kind of like a placebo effect or if it's something I'm just imagining but that's kind of my experience so far with it. Like I said, I don't really know. The only, it's not like this would gain a lot of horsepower or it's gonna make you lose a lot of horsepower. You would probably not feel it just by sitting in the truck. Okay, and now the engine sound. From outside and at idle, it sounds basically the same as stock to me. But when I'm cruising inside the cabin, it seems like it has a little bit of a lower tone to it now. Not as high pitch as the V8 is in 100% stock form once you get over 4,000 uh, RPMs. It kind of has like this little bit of a rasp. Um, with this filter, that rasp kind of gone away and it's, it, to me anyway, it seems a little bit lower. So there you have it guys. 
quick little video on how to change your air filter and some feedback on the filter itself. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button below.